Good morning, Clark Henry Gallup fans. It's just gone half past seven, and we're here with the preview of today's racing at Hollywood Bet Scottsville. We've got eight races carded today, and the Ghost Rider sent through his selection, saying it is a very difficult program today. Not easy at all in his eyes. And we'll run through the races right now and tell you what his intended place accumulator will be. He's got two value bets at the end of the show as well. Let's have a look at the changes first. Firstly, just a little bit about the track. It's at Scottsville today. The track condition is good, and the penetrometer readings are 22. The false rail is set up nine meters. They've had no rainfall in the last week, and the irrigation figure in the last 24 hours is two millimeters. It's cloudy with morning showers, so a 40% chance of rain today down in Peter Maritzburg. Jockey's not riding today. J.P. Fendermeva and Kanya Sakai not riding today. I'm going to run through the races right now. Let's go to the first of the day, first of eight races on the Scottsville track. And uh, as we said, the going is good. The PA will start in race two. The bipod starts in race one. It's a maiden plate over 1,000 meters. You can scratch numbers nine, Hyatt, and 12, Let Me Go. Those are the two withdrawals. Number two, Lord Edward is still with Arda Ryder. And number four, Got Her Fate is now ridden by Ryan Munger. Note that Got Her Fate races with a Cornell collar. So the selection here is number six to win it. It's Stanley Park, the son of Oratorio for Garth Puller and Ant McGoodler. In fact, the Ghost Rider says, follow the Garth Puller stable today. They seem to have uh, a lot of good, decent runners. So follow Garth Puller today. Stanley Park is tipped to beat number one in Dhaka. Third is given to number 11, Global Path. And fourth to number eight, Gold Enzyme. If you want to go wider, include the first timer, the son of Captain of All, number five, Captain Spirit. And number seven, Slim Janie. Let's move over to the second race, start of the PA at one o'clock. It's a Phillies and Mares 94 handicap over 1,000 meters. And in the second of the day, you can take up number four, Irish Bell is a non-runner. Number six, Ancient Epic is the Mount of Muzi Yen, who had such a good day yesterday. Number seven, Nakia is still without a rider. None as yet there. Here the tip is number five, Maquette for Duncan House and Tabiso Gumede to beat home number one, Auntie Lizzie. Third given to number seven, Nikia. And then fourth to number two, Louis Louis Diamonds. So five, one, seven, and two in the second. Race three starts off the pick six at 25 to two this afternoon. It's a maiden plate to be run over 1400 meters. In the third, two scratchings, number two, Soul Captain and number five, Venerable out of the third, two and five. Number 11, Captain of the Green is without a rider still in race three. Here the Ghost Rider is siding with number seven, uh, Prometer to win it. Um, Prometere, I don't know if that's the way they pronounce it, but number seven, Prometere uh, to win this race for Dean Canamere and Sean Veal. To beat him, number nine, without question. Third goes to number eight, American Dream. And fourth to number 12, Winter Pearl. Winter Pearl, interestingly, sported a set of blinkers today. Moving into the fourth race at 10 past two, a merit-rated 68 handicap. It's over 1,200 metres. And in race four, there are no scratchings. The jockey changes for number 11, the Bayou. Now, Calvin Corbo, 13 quest for the best, still without a rider at this stage. In the fourth, number two, Monsoon Kenny has a compression mask fitted. And number six, Happy Wanderer, Alamites in front, unshot behind. On to our selections. Well, this is very wide open. According to the Ghost Rider, any one of eight can win it here. Yeah? So it looks like the field race in his eyes. He's tipping number five, Metallic Gold, as the value bet here to win, the son of Flying the Flag. To beat him in second, number 10, Imitation Game. Third goes to number 13, Quest for the Best. And fourth to number four, Two of Us. For inclusion are all of three, Grey Ocean, who tries Blinker Pacifiers. Six, Happy Wanderer. Further down the page, numbers 12, Father's Frost, and even 14, Sir Pom, who I know he tipped as the uh, price booster last time up, which ran two lengths down Putin's promise after losing three lengths at the jump. So wide open race four, you must play wide there. Race five is offered quarter to three. It's a Phillies and Mayor 76 handicap over 1,200 metres. And in race five, you can scratch number one, Ethiopian Queen, a non-runner. 
Here number two, Lazuli, is written by apprentice Gabriel Peterser. Gabriel only claims one and a half kilograms. Lazuli has a compression mask on. Number four, Gardenia, Alamite in front, unshot behind. And you can put blinkers on number seven, Princess T. Note that number two, Lazuli, now runs in the colors of Mario Ferreira. The colors you're looking out for if you back that one are light green and red. Well, on to the selection for race five. The Ghost Rider is tipping number five to win it. Ride the Lightning. This is, again, Garth Puller teaming up with Serena Mudley. Second to number 11, Amarandi. Third, number nine, Desert Pride. And fourth goes to number three, Live My Life. For inclusion, number two, Lazuli, as well as number 10, Snow Tune. Moving into race six now, 25 past three. This is a Phillies and Mayor 67 handicap over 1,600 metres. In the sixth of the day, you can take out numbers five, Hot Strike, and eight, Global Secret. Scratched here, numbers five and eight. In race, uh, that's uh, race six. Uh, race six, number 10, a little bit naughty, is written by Jason Gates. That's an update of the jockey there in race number six and those are the changes let's go to the tip it is for number six to win it family favorite this is in fact the second of the value bets today mozzieni teams up with dennis bosch second to number 10 a little bit naughty third number eight which is now a scratching as i mentioned global secret has come out so put in number seven uh, reckless love wherever you see the eight tipped to run back in third then let's move on to the seventh, the penultimate of the day at 4 p.m. It is a uh, feature race, the listed off to stud stakes over 1,600 metres. Many of these mares are going off to stud now in race seven. There are no scratchings, but number four, time to roll, is still without a rider in race number seven. Here the selection going to it. It's number 11 to win it. Humdinger for Mike Decock and Cabela Matsignani is to contend with a wide draw, but it's tipped to beat him in second number two, which is Mount Laurel. Third goes to number seven, uh, Keep On Dancing, and fourth to number four, Time to Roll, 11, two, seven, and four. Bear in mind that he does fancy as well, numbers eight, Makara, and ten, Admire Me, to finish up there in the seventh. The eighth and last race runs at 25 to five. It's a maiden plate. It's over 1,750 metres. Scratch number 13, Kojima Mfana. That's out. Number seven, So Daka. Will race with Alamites in front, unshot behind, and also races with a compression mask fitted. Note that number eight, Dawn Mission, now runs for Mr. R. Herchand. The colors are Cerise and Aquamarine Green. So those are the selections for today. It looks like a tricky day out at Scottsville. And next up, we'll have your place accumulator numbers confirmation of those. All right, let's go on to our... Tips now as far as the PA is concerned. The bet today by the Ghost Rider is a 576 Rand place accumulator permutation. If you want to take it for 10%, that'll cost you 57 Rand 60 and 20%, 115 Rand 20. Remember the PA starts in race number two. Here, the first leg, one and five, Auntie Lizzie and Maquette. The second leg, seven and nine, Prometere and without question. The third leg, four numbers. Numbers four, two of us, five metallic gold, 10 imitation game, and 13 quest for the best. By five, nine, and 11, being Ride the Lightning, Desert Pride, and Amarandi. Then six, eight, and 10. Now, uh, that's the race where there was the scratching. So family favorite um, was tipped as one of the horses there. So you're going to replace that now with uh, the other horse, which I thought was the nine that he tipped, give me a lullaby. So instead of the eight, um, you're going to put in the nine. So it'll be six. Uh, in fact, seven. It is seven. Six, seven, and ten. So Reckless Love replaces the eight there. So it's six, seven, and ten in that leg where he's gone. Six, eight, and ten. By two and eleven in the next leg, Mount Laurel and Humdinger. And the last leg, eight and fourteen, Dawn Mission and uh, Zubery in that last leg of the bet there, eight and 14. Right, the value bets for today, race four, number five, metallic gold, seven to one before eight o'clock on a Sunday morning. And race six, number six, family favorite is as good as 10 to one. Maybe take that place double for you today if you're listening to the Ghost Rider, who was in terrific form 
about a week or so ago. That's it for today. No racing tomorrow. Note that, folks. There's no local South African racing tomorrow. So we'll be back on the public holiday Tuesday because that is another Turfentain day. Looking forward to being with you then from the entire Clock in the Gallop team. Have a great Sunday. Bye-bye.